Isang magandang buhay para sa ating lahat. Now, we're going to discuss for the parallel and perpendicular lines. So, pag nakikita natin kasi sometimes, di ba, nakikita natin yan. Hindi lang natin alam, ah, parallel pala yun. Yun pala ang parallel. Yun pala ang perpendicular. Basta, basta nakita natin ang lines ay magkaharap or magka face to face sila kumbaga yun ay parallel parallel i mean pagka naman ang perpendicular is nagkukan siya sa 90 degrees or nasa gitna siya di ba ng line parang ganun so makikita niyo ko ano ibig sabihin natin okay so we have quick review so what is the slope intercept form okay naalala niyo di ba we have discussed this formula so we have here y is equal to mx plus b yan yung ating slope-intercept formula. And then, for the standard form, AX plus BY is equal to C. That is the standard form. Okay. E, paano may point slope form? So, that is Y minus Y. 1 is equal to M multiplied by quantity of X minus X sub 1. Kasi, guys, sometimes, Y2 minus Y1 or X2 minus X1, parehas lang yun. Kasi, it means, Para bang final minus initial. Parang ganyan niya. Parehas lang yun. So, we have here, find the negative reciprocal of each fraction. So, pag na, ito, paano mga ito? Makukuha yung negative reciprocal niyan. That is a negative 5 over 2, negative 7 over 3, and then 2, and then we have here 3 over 4. Ito yung negative reciprocal. Kung baga, kabaliktaran niya. Okay. So, we have here, sabi nga dyan, parallel lines that never intersect. Yun yung parallel line. Di ba sabi ko nga sa inyo, magkatapat sila, pero hindi sila nag, nagkakaroon ng intersection. Parang ganon. Okay, so yan. No? Parang di ba, ganyan yung ating parallel. Yan. So, parallel line. Magkatapat. Pero never sila nag-intersect. Yung mata yun. So, yan yun. Okay, next. So, we have here, so, the slope of the red line, ayan, ano nga ba ang slope ng red? That is one half, di ba? Ng red line. Eh, paano naman yung blue line? Also one half. So, parehas sila ng slope, ang ibig niyang sabihin. So, pa kung parehas ang slope nila, ibig sabihin, parallel sila sa isa't isa. Okay? So, you know, same. Ayan. So, we have to determine if the lines are parallel. We have to check. So, we have here 2x plus 6y is equal to 12 and y is equal to negative one-third of x plus 5. So, we have here 2x plus 6y is equal to 12. So, pag nilipat natin sa kabila yung 2x, so it will come negative 2x plus 12. So, solving for the y, divide natin both side by 6 ito. 6 yan. yan. And this one is 6. So, kaya negative one-third of x plus so, ito yung ating slope. Ayan. Check natin the other one. Oh, pareha sila, di ba? So, ibig sabihin, they are parallel. Di ba? Okay. Next. So, check natin ito. 6x plus 8 is equal to negative 24. So, transpose sa kabila. We'll get negative 6x. So, divide both sides by 8. And this one is 8. So, negative 3 over 4. Oh, guys, this is a negative. Eh, ito ay positive. Parehas ba siya? Okay, so, hindi. Okay, next. So, 4x plus 6y is equal to negative 2. And y is 2 third of x minus 8. So, check ulit natin. So, ilipat natin yung 4x sa kabila. Negative 4x minus 2. Divide both sides by 6. So, nakita nyo, negative 2 third to. Oh, it is 2 third. So, it means no. Okay, next. So, we have here an equation uh, of line that contains a 5 and 1. And it's parallel to y is equal to 3 over 5 of x minus 4. Okay, so we have here, the slope is 3 over 5. Ayan. So, pag ginamit natin formula, point slope ay yung yung form natin kangina, point slope, so we have here, y minus 1 is equal to 3 over 5. Ito yun. Diba, remember, this is your y1 and x1. Diba? Ayan. Okay, magtataka kayo saan ang galing yan. So, we have here, ayan, nakuha natin ito. Ito, equation yan. 
yan yung equation natin di ba okay so we have here another problem so we have here same procedure so we have the slope and then point slope natin is si bakit siya naging positive because this is negative multiplied by negative 6 so it will become positive because this is x1 and then this is y1 okay so pag chinek mo yan 3 di ba yun yung 3 okay so x minus 2 so yan yung equation natin madali lang di ba okay next so we have here so same thing ganun pa rin 1 half so x plus 4 di ba remember this is a negative times negative 4 will become positive because this will be your x1 and y1 okay i hope na nakakasulod kayo so so a line a line passes through the negative 3 and negative 1 and is parallel to the graph of y is equal to x plus 3 what is the equation represent the line is slope intercept form so we have here the point slope natin that is negative um negative 3 and point natin i mean this will be our point ayan yung point natin ito yan then you position line so 3 and negative 3 and negative 1 where slope is 2 ayan so from the point slope formula so we have y minus y1 is equal to m multiplied x minus x1 so substituting the value of y1 ayan this is negative 1 and x1 is negative 3 so we have here y plus 1 is equal to multiply the 2x plus 3 over equals y plus 1 is equal to x kasi multiply natin to dito diba ayan okay so this will be your final answer kasi pag hindi pa sa word that's negative 1 so 6 minus 1 is 5 okay so nakuha natin yung ating sagot na equation okay paano naman daw perpendicular sabi nga dyan lines that intersect to form a right triangle Yun nga yung 90 degrees, di ba? Sinasabi ko kangina. Okay. So, parang ganyan, di ba? Kasi ito yung 90 degrees. Ayan. Ito rin 90 degrees. Parang ganyan. Kaya nga, pag-chinek mo yung right triangle yan. Okay. Or right angles pala, I mean. Okay. So, we have, what is the slope of the red line? So, negative 1 fourth. Ayan. The other one is 4 over 1. Pansin mo, hindi sila magkamukha ng slope. Yun yung perpendicular. Okay. Kumbaga, negative reciprocal nung isa. Okay. Ayan. So, we have here an equation of the line that passes through it to N4. So, it's perpendicular to Y is equal to 1 third X minus 1. Where slope is, ayan, ayan na nga. And then, point is 2 and 4. Ayan. So, we have here opposite of inverse that is of slope that is negative 3 for this one, di ba? Pag kinuha natin negative reciprocal niyan, that is a negative 3. Okay. So, we have here using the point slope. So, we have y minus y1 is equal to m equals to x minus x sub 1. So, where value of y1 is 4, so y minus 4 is equal to negative 3. So, x times negative multiplied with value of 2 kasi this is x1 and y1, di ba? Okay, so we're getting the negative 3 multiplied for this one, yan. Yan. So, will become positive nga ito, di ba? Kasi negative, negative. So, we have here, the final answer natin for this equation is negative 3x plus 10. So, that, yun yung hinahanap natin. Okay, so, <laughs> we have here, yan. So, Nakuha na na, nakalito na kagad. So, this will be your yan, slope na negative, di ba? Reciprocal. For, for the perpendicular, di ba? Yan yung slope, kabaliktaran, di ba? So, we have here 5 and 1 half. Okay. So, madali lang, di ba? So, find the equation of the line that contains a 0 and negative 2 and is perpendicular to y is equal to y is equal to 5x plus 3. So, we have here, uh, oh, diba? remember, this is negative reciprocal, negative one-half, and then this one is, ayan, sinaptitude lang natin, 
X. Bakit ang wala isa? Kasi nga zero, di ba? Yung X natin. Ayan. So, mga wala talaga. So, ito naman. So, ganun din. So, ito, pag uh, kinuha natin negative reciprocal, that's negative 4 over 3, and Y minus 8, negative 4 over 3, X minus 1, for this one. Using the point slope, di ba? O, ito. O, try nyo. Ano ba ang slope nito? Okay. So, pag nakuha nyo ay positive 2, tama ang slope nyo. And then, substitute that for the point slope formula. We have here, this is 1, is y plus 3 is equal to multiple x minus 2. Okay. Very good. Ayan. So, we have to determine that the lines are perpendicular. Check nga natin. So, we have here, ayan. 3y plus 2x is equal to 4. So, that is negative 2x. And then, negative 2x. 2x over 3x plus 4 so ano ba? ano sagot? yes or no? no bakit? hindi kasi sila reciprocal although this is negative pero hindi sila reciprocal that is dapat ang sagot yan is negative 3 over 2 diba? determine if the lines are perpendicular ayan So, this will be a yes. Ayan. Bakit? Kasi nga, di ba, ayan, kabaliktaran na ng perpendicular. Ayan. That is 3 over 2. At negative pa. Okay. Ay, bakit noon lumito dyan? Yes yan, hindi yan no. That is a yes. Okay. Okay, so hanggang dito na lang ating ang lecture. I hope na masundan nyo sa susunod na lecture natin. So maraming salamat. Ciao!